Once upon a time, our hunter-gatherer ancestors believed that the entire universe was limited to what they could see around them. Then, humanity placed itself at the center of the cosmos, imagining that everything in the sky revolved around us while the Earth stood still. Later, we discovered that the Sun seemed to be at the center, and our planet actually orbited it. But even that turned out not to be the full picture. The Sun is just one of billions of stars surrounded by our galaxy, the Milky Way. For a long time, we believed this vast galaxy was the entire universe, and honestly, given its immensity, it wasn't such a strange assumption. But today, we know that the universe doesn't end with our galaxy. There are hundreds of billions of other galaxies scattered across the observable cosmos. According to current estimates, the diameter of the observable universe is around 93 billion light years. What lies beyond that? We don't know. But maybe, one day, we'll be adding a new line to this story. Once, we believed there was only one universe until we discovered that we're part of a mega hyperspace filled with an infinite number of parallel universes. Why not? In fact, maybe all these parallel universes aren't somewhere far away at all. Maybe they're right here, layered on top of ours, hidden in plain sight. Imagine this. In one universe, you might be living an average life, commuting to work, coming home to your family, sharing ordinary joys and struggles. But in another universe, your alternate self could be a billionaire. In yet another, you might be a world-renowned physicist. Unless, tragically, you died young in a car accident. Some scientists believe the Big Bang wasn't the beginning of everything. Instead, it could have been a phase transition, a moment between dimensions, in fact, the very logic of the Big Bang necessitates the existence of other universes, even if we haven't yet found proof. Quantum Physics and the Multiverse As I've discussed in previous videos, the quantum world is full of strange behaviors. Atoms can exist in multiple places at once. Otacord orticles act like both waves and solid objects. Emerging particles can communicate instantly across cosmic distances. This is quantum entanglement. These oddities led to one of the most mind-bending ideas of modern science, parallel universes. This idea gained traction through something called the many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics. If you've heard of the double slit experiment, you know that an electron behaves like a wave, existing in many places at once, until it is observed. Then, it collapses into a single position. But what if that collapse doesn't happen the way we think? Physicist Hugh Everett proposed that when we observe a particle, we don't collapse its possibilities. Instead, the entire universe splits into all the possible outcomes. Each possibility becomes real, in its own parallel world. So instead of the wave function collapsing, reality branches. Let's dive a little deeper. In the double slit experiment, when electrons are fired at a barrier with two slits, they behave like waves and create an interference pattern. Unless we observe them. When we observe them, they stop behaving like waves and act like particles, leaving two simple lines behind the slits. Why? According to Everett's theory, it's not that the electron changes behavior. It's that the universe splits, creating a version for every possible outcome. That means there are infinite versions of our universe, each slightly different from the next. Where are these universes? It may seem impossible for all these alternate worlds to coexist, but according to quantum theory, they could be like overlapping slices, sharing the same time axis, but with different spatial dimensions. They're layered on top of each other, inaccessible but very real. And if that's true, then every possible future already exists. Every choice you could make leads to a different timeline. That brings us to a profound idea. 
If our decisions shape our path across all potential space-times, then maybe free will is real after all. And if all possible futures exist, so do all possible pasts. Time travel, at least in theory, might just be possible. The Infinite Universe Model Now, imagine this. If the universe is truly infinite, then everything must exist somewhere. That includes copies of you, me, and our entire planet. The particles that form us, like Lego blocks, can only arrange themselves in so many ways. In an infinite cosmos, exact duplicates are mathematically inevitable. Somewhere, beyond the edges of our observable universe, there may be another Earth, identical in every way. And not just one. There could be countless versions, each with different choices, different histories, different futures. M-theory, the theory of everything. There are two main theories that explain our universe today. Einstein's general relativity for the cosmic scale and quantum mechanics for the microscopic scale. These two theories don't easily mix. But a unifying idea, string theory, suggests that everything is made up of tiny, vibrating strings. Eventually, physicists proposed a more comprehensive idea, M-theory. According to M-theory, Threaten's universe is not 3D, but 11-dimensional. Each slice of the universe is like a membrane, or brain, and these membranes can collide. They may cause a new Big Bang, birthing a new universe. Our universe, then, may have been born from just such a collision. And if true, the multiverse isn't just possible, it's inevitable. If parallel universes exist, then so do alternate versions of every major historical event. Audio universe where Nazi Germany won World War II, Audio universe where the Cold War went nuclear, Lancaster, Seafell Earth where humanity never knew war. In a truly infinite multiverse, everything that can happen does happen. If one day we confirm this, if science proves that our universe is just one of trillions, maybe even infinite, well, I don't know about you, but for me, that would be the most mind-blowing discovery of my life. And still, even as we try to imagine these things, we struggle to grasp the vastness of our current universe. But here on this channel, we'll keep trying. We'll keep exploring the unknown, pushing the boundaries of the mind, and chasing truth through the light of science. Until next time, stay curious.